And I, I think the point is that what I want to see is um, it not fail. And what I'm concerned about is if we've got these huge numbers not attending four-year-old, am I guaranteed, you know, can we be certain that they're not going to, you know, are they going to attend three-year-olds? So there is no doubt that we're all committed to the early education space and to get as much early education into children's lives. No question about that. And we already, you, you know that we already do that with healthcare card holders, ch uh, kids with in, in, under child protection or in, Indigenous kids who have that ability already. Um, and some of those areas are already identified. And that, that's, that's a very good thing because some of those children, as I said earlier, um, they're the ones you don't want to be falling off further. You need them to be having that very solid education. So there's no doubt we're committed to it. What I'm concerned about is we need to get the four-year-old right too. And we need to look at working at all levels of government because it's a complex area. You've got feds, you've got state and you've got the local government and it's not, it's, it's inequitable across those three tiers. Um, as Nina highlighted in, you know, the complexity of the system. So I think we need to look at it in detail. I need to look at it more in detail to see how that we actually get it right.